Okay. Well, welcome back guys. And let's get this set up right and let's get the recap of what happened last time. Previously on The Walking Dead. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. I only need a minute. It'll put you out of your misery right then. When I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. Broken people get reckless. Here. Things start heading south. Don't let them drag you down with them. You got it. Who are you fucking shooting? Don't let the deal. Drop it. Drop it. Don't move. Don't move. Sam, don't move. Everybody, be cool. Here's a shot that started it all. So let's just see who survived that little firefight we had. We got Luke, Clementine. Fuck you, you Kenny. There's the little baby. We're gonna crop to crawl for it, aren't we? Shut up! I said shut up! Okay. 
Kenny, what are you doing? I'm ending this. Get out here, right fucking now! This is my shield, the dust! The new thing! The duck, my queen! I'm a duck, my queen! Oh, no. Get out here! Dramatic from that guy. <laughs> Safe to come out. Hello. Here, I got him. And where was she the whole time? Jesus Christ. That was, uh, that was intense. I thought, man, I thought that was it. Was for these assholes. Thanks for coming back. I didn't know this man. I never killed someone that didn't wrong me in some way, that didn't deserve it. I tried I to pretend he was a walker, but it's different. You but I didn't think killed the guy that was trying to kill us. us. Yeah, that's why I did it, but I felt wrong. Come on. Okay. How did this happen? She turned. Just like that. Don't you go blaming yourself, Kenny. You did what you had to, to protect the boy. She just lost too much blood. Ain't nobody's fault. You know, we could have done better by her. She was just too far gone. She's with Alvin now. Yeah, yeah, she is. Don't worry, Becca. We'll take care of your boy. You <sighs> rest easy. Uh, who's that? Ar oh, there's Arvo. <gasps> you piece of shit! Hey, hey! Stop! Stop. Get off me! Come on! It's over, man. He ain't a threat to us. Can he can give him a little beating. Of course he is! Get out of the way! Whoa! What are you doing? I'm doing the same thing this asshole tried to do to us! It doesn't have to go down like that. Kenny, please! He's just a scared kid, man. He wasn't the one shooting at us. That guy's dead. Just because he don't have a gun doesn't mean he wouldn't have. Well, he didn't, so leave him alone! That is house, food. Please. Please, I can take you. Bullshit! No, no. It's true. We have place. Not far. For food. See? He wants to help. Mm. Oh, don't be stupid. He's just trying to save his skin. Why the hell would you help us, huh? I... I now want to see more people dead. Then close your eyes and I'll make it quick. <laughs> Kenny, back off. If he's telling the truth, it could save all of us. We need the food. We need the food. None of this will matter if we all starve to death. She's right, Kenny. We're running low on supplies as it is. It's worth the risk to check this place out. Trust him, don't trust him. It doesn't matter. We should go anyway. We just need to be careful. It can't be far from here. You stay out of this. You're the reason these fuckers came after us in the first place. Don't try and pin this on me. Lay off, Kenny. She just helped us. Look, don't start off. Yeah, I decided not to I was do there anything. With her. It's my fault, too. Think about the baby, Kenny. If there are supplies, we need them. We ain't gonna last much longer without more food. We gotta take a chance. Unless someone's got a better plan. We got something to tie this shit bird up? Yeah, I got something. Follow me, I thank you. Oops. 
Just give me a reason. Yeah, man, he gets it. So we didn't lose anybody, or we lost uh, Rebecca during that fight, but it wasn't because of the fight. Look, I know you're probably pissed about me leaving. When I heard the gunshots, I, I knew it was a mistake. If it helps, the thing I'd normally do is walk away for good, but I didn't. Despite what my instincts are telling me, despite <laughs> want, everything okay. I've seen, everything I've been through. I'm not pissed. I'm glad you're back. I didn't want you to go in the first place. Thanks. That's, that's good. Because you're probably 90% of the reason I came back. And it'd probably get pretty annoying if you hated me the whole time. Wouldn't want it to be annoying. You didn't no. come back because of, that would suck. Because of Luke? You came back I'm because of me? I'm gonna try to make this work. All I can do is promise you I won't abandon you again. Which, to be fair, I've never done before. Even though I probably should have. A few times now. You don't gotta point the gun at him the whole time. You forget what we just went through? He ain't going anywhere, Kenny. No need to get your arm off. Uh, he's a little bit of a gimp. He can't run off that Kenny. fast. He's... He's in a dark place. We gotta keep an eye on him. Everything he's been through. But he's lost. It's changing him. He'll be okay. I've known him a while. Well, it's he... all starting to pile up. It's mm. weighing on him. I don't know. Everyone has a breaking point. You're the only one that he trusts. That he really trusts. That means you're the one that's gonna have to pull him back. Great, so... He's counting on you. <sighs> if we're really going to make this work... I'll do my best. I know. You're saying that we might lose Kenny? And Come I'm, on, the, I'm the only one ke keeping him sane? That's not gonna be good. So they have the Wait two up. people that got Wait. shot Wait. helping Wait. each other. No, no, I'm I'm fine. Hey, I just need a second. Sorry, I just I just put more weight on it than I should have. All right, wait there. Hey, what I say? When I tell you something, you fucking listen. You understand? Can come on. There's no need for that. He's getting what he deserves. Fucking talking to you. I say stop. You'd best stop. If you know what's good for you. Kenny! He understands. Just fucking stay put. So I'm now I gotta really worry about what I say when I'm talking to Kenny. You? Yeah, yeah. Uh, go on and talk to him. I got Clem if I need anything. Okay. Here, just take the baby. Uh, okay. You guys. What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to let each other know how tough they are. Put them in their place. Bunch of dominant alpha male horse shit. And it all ends the same way. But don't look at me. I ain't that guy. Oh, if that ain't true. You get in your fair share of pissing matches, too. Do I? Are you kidding me? Yes, they're not all like that. There are good men, too. My friend Lee, he was a good man. Lee, well, I wish I had had a chance to Melvin, meet him. Marvin. Me too. I wish he was here now. Guess it took a woman to talk some sense into him. Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. Hey, Bonnie. Yeah. I'm sorry. For what? I'll be right back. Ah. Damn it, screw. 
grab some snow and put it on there. How are you feeling? If I'm being honest, I've been better. No, leaned up against a tree, bullet in my leg. But alive. <laughs> when so many of my friends are dead, for no good reason. Yeah, okay. <laughs> you guys, their group is tiny now, compared to what it was when we first joined. Everyone we set out with just gone. Nick, Pete, Alvin, and Becca, Carlos, Sarah, and for what? You can't blame yeah. yourself. It wasn't your fault. No, not completely. I could have done more, and that ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones, and I gotta live with it. All right, Mr. Bork. That's perfect. What I miss? Nothing. Hmm? Uh, nothing much. You know, complaining mostly. I was just mentioning how cold it is lately. Yeah. Good thing you got that cool jacket, huh? I'm sure most of that'll come out with a little soap and water. <laughs> I'm fine. The blood, don't worry about the blood. Hey, Clem, go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. I offer, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. Maybe he'll let you do it. Okay. Okay. Why not? Stay the girl. Let the kid do everything, you know? That's gonna sting, but only for a second. It's gonna clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's gonna suck. It's gotta get done. Go on. You can do it. Uh, I know I can do it, but Kenny might punch me <laughs> once I pour that in his eye socket. I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. What do you think? Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin if it was a boy. I mean, His parents would have liked Rebecca it. Rebecca was so out of it she hadn't settled on her name. Huh? Yeah, I like it. Yeah, I like Alvin Junior. It is. Agree with him on that. Like that. Make him happy. Well, I think AJ approves. What do you uh, got there? Cause I think I'm all right. I mentioned it earlier. To Bonnie. I'm, I'm changing, changing your bandage. bandage. Demand Sounds it. like I don't have much choice in the matter. You don't. You shouldn't have to do stuff like this. Shouldn't have to do a lot of things. All right. Let's get it over with. Hopefully it don't scare this little guy. Or you. Oh, here we go. Let's take a peek under the dressing. So how's it look? Still gonna be pretty when this heals? Well, it looks a lot better <laughs> than it did. And maybe my modeling days ain't over. Okay. Dress the clean the bandage. Well, that's not the bandage, that's just the cloth. So I'm guessing this is gonna be the shitty part. Not telling the truth, I so hurt like hell. This is gonna hurt like hell. Well, you could have lied a little, you know. Never to you, Kenny. Uh, holy fucking hell. You need to stop squirming. Yeah. Yeah, okay. You're right. about the language, Junior. You're gonna be tougher than me when you're grown. I'm gonna expect you to be more of a gentleman than I am. Man, is that smart. You can hear a few bad words. I heard plenty. Yeah. Yep. That shouldn't have been the case. I should have gave myself up. Alvin didn't have to die like that. I'm gonna think about that 
every time I look at Alvin Jr. here. Alvin should be here raising this boy. It should be him, not me. The best thing you can do for Alvin and Rebecca is raise him right. Make yep. sure he's safe. I intend to. Is that a clean bandage? The same one? Where'd I get the clean one if <laughs> I pull it out of my butt? All done. Thank you, sweetie. Yep. Are we ready to go? Okay, it's a clean one. Let's head out. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you! What? It? it? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us! He doesn't speak much English. Yeah, no shit! Arvo, we're not trying to be mean. We're not trying to be mean, but where's the food? This is where the supplies are. Is this the place you're taking us? Are the supplies here? No, it's at the house. There's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. <sighs> Thank you. No misery. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. Luke needs huh? a break. We're not where we were. We probably all do. Look, I'll do whatever you guys want. Okay. I could use the rest. It'd be safer to rest in there, where there's a fence. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. Sure. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. Uh-oh. Here we go. Babysitting time. No, that's all you. <laughs> Natural. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. <laughs> He's annoying. That's a good sign. <laughs> you take it. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Here, I got him. Come on over. It's safe. Ugh. We got a fence, we got a fire, things are looking up. So Our road's tied birthday. up far away from it. Near as I can tell, at least. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. So, that makes you... what? 27? That's, that's right, I'm surprised you remember. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork waiting to collect. Probably. And what did you study? Majored in art history. 
That's cool. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. You get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion there. All it being your birthday and all. Figure. This is as good a time as any. Mm. Where did you get it? Bill kept all the alcohol in the armory. He didn't like people imbibing. What's that mean? Drinking. He, he didn't think people should drink. Feel a little guilty taking the first Whoa, thing. wait. You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. Why not? <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? <laughs> I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. We can't be too careful. The baby might be cold. Nah, I'll keep him warm. He's a tough little guy. Come on, Kenny. Just sit a little while longer. Nah, you stay warm. Glenn, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Why would you even Thanks, think about Kenny. taking the baby away from the fire? It's gonna get cold out there regardless. Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. So I wonder if there is a way for me to have Just dialogue with her earlier on, which would have prevented her from coming back. Well, she I helped missed, us out I missed all that. Dang it. That puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about her. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. It was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. Guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey. All right. All right, it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. <laughs> we got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. It's my fault for bringing it up. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes. That, that is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. The both of you. <laughs> Was that Maybe for? she came back for you. A little jealousy? Could be. I don't know what to say to that. Maybe she I likes him. Maybe she likes him? <laughs> well, I think we could bet on that. Because you see here, Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Worked on me. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry, it's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thought. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this to change the mouth. Has anybody checked on Arvo? Okay, he's still there. That's good. There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. Just, uh, needed some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there after 
Sarita was... I just... I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. We don't have anything to apologize for. I know you didn't mean it. Thanks. Like I said, we I gotta my boy. we gotta watch what we're saying around Kenya so right now. Much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple of years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. If I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Doug. To touch Conscious Face. Anything in the world. I really liked Katya. She was one of the nicest people I've ever met. She was nice. She had a big heart. To get it broken like that it was too much for her. It should have been too much for me. It's cool. Well, if you had to him. shoot your own He's son, gonna get raised right. it might have been. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. The baby might be cold. Maybe you should bring him by the fire. Yeah, okay. All right. We convinced Kenny to rejoin the group without giving him a, a sip. Uh, where is... There she is. Look at sign... I don't think she's going to take it. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Probably been a while for everyone. Will it work? work? That depends. What is it? <laughs> How are the kids rum? supposed to know? Probably. I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to. Because you made it. <laughs> you know. Be around. It'll only be weird if you make it weird. Just be cool. Just be cool, you know? You know? Just I be wish cool. It was that easy. Relax. It is. People just love making it harder than it has to be. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? A blood oath. We all put our blood in that room. Really good. Heavy on the Have iron. Got any? You want a sip? Really? It's okay. It just might burn a little. Uh, I'm a kid. Uh, okay then. Suit yourself. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? I was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. Ooh, sounds like aftershock. I, I, was. I know somebody had a bad experience with that stuff. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals. <laughs> and yep. I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. Sounds like a mess. Sounds yeah, like a big mess. It was. Every couple years, someone would step on a piece of glass that didn't get swept up and get mad at me all over again. The problem with glass is, it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. You ate glass? I ate glass. Wow. I haven't thought about that in a long time. I guess a deal's a deal. 
Here. Time to not make it weird. Hey, I convinced her too. Look at me. I'm making everybody be friends over here. Wanna sit here? No. That's I'm would've, fine. Would have been funny. She walks up. So <laughs> oh, this one time yeah. I ate glass. Okay. Wherever you like. <laughs> I guess we gotta go talk to Arvo. Yep. Uh, <laughs> Jane, you don't have to justify that with a response. Hey, I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. Shh, shh. All right, enough of that. Hey, you Clem. It's nice Wait. to hear people laughing. Did I, what, yeah. did I click on Arvo? Why am I yes. talking to these people? You just spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> well, yeah, it does. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. He needs it as much as anyone right now. It's a nice thing to do. I said my piece. I said my piece. I don't think that boy's a bad person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. They do it a lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. So I think it's best. Leave to me alone! Jeez. Sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't have. Leave me alone! Stop yelling. <laughs> Speak in Russian. It's okay. It's okay. She's in a better place. <laughs> it's okay. Speaking Russian. It's okay. This didn't give me a translation. Come on. Maybe it's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long a walk we got tomorrow? Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll take first watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really. I uh, don't mention it. You did good. It was nice while it lasted. Well, that was a very uneventful night then. You sure you're good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, will you do that? No trouble. How much further? Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. I'm really starting to think you're full of shit. Behind you! What the fuck? Ah! Ah! Jesus Christ! That was close. Fucker came out of nowhere! That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Uh, Come. I hope that wasn't a... a multiple choice thing. I just saw... Shoot. <laughs> there. Piece of shit. It's half built. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. 
I'd just like a place to sit, if I'm honest. As long as there's food, who cares what it looks like? You're not gonna right, think we that were outside all night. A couple inches of snow covering you. We didn't have a roof over our head last night. What's the big deal? Are we just gonna walk over? It's a frozen lake. Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Say it in an American asshole. It's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. Maybe we shouldn't clump together. We just can't have too much weight. She's right. We need to spread out. Just to be safe. Less weight, the better. Let the Rusky go first, since he's so confident. It's okay. Rusky. <laughs> Rusky. I like that. <laughs> okay, so can I go left or right? I can't. That has to be really unnerving. We're okay. Don't worry. Uh -oh. We got some walkers behind us. That's only a few of them. We should be all right. Let's just get to the house. Hey, stay with us. Fuck. That's too less to deal with. Just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey! Motherfucker! Shit! Uh -oh. It's gonna kill him! <gasps> Kenny! Get back here, you piece of shit! We should let you drown, you piece of shit! No! Kenny! Don't hurt him! Hey, he's probably gonna lose a toe. I just got water in them shoes. Well, they made it. Uh oh. Throw us the gun. Get rid of the gun. Don't come over here. Hey, I can make it. It's it's fine. You sure? Yeah. You got walkers on the way. Let me help it's too you. Too thin for both of us. I just. Just gotta be careful. Oh, no, no! Stop! Stop! I'm fine! I'm fine! No, you're not! I just gotta pull myself out. You need help, Luke! The ice is too thin. I got it. You need the help. No! Yeah, I'm a kid. I'm small. I don't weigh as much. So help no, Clem, Clem, do not! Just go back for him. You're flat. You Stop can do telling it. her that! Clem, look at me. Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Claim you can make it, but you need to go. No. Now. Clem, this is too dangerous. Oh, He's gonna oh. die. Just need some more time. You guys gotta hurry. Just fall through. I can figure I'll it out. Do it, Clem. Cover it. Thanks. Thanks. I'll be on a sec. Just, just keep shooting. You're not gonna make I, I, it. My leg. I just Hold need on. him. I got you. Rest a sec. Just keep him off us, Clem. No, no. Too much. Too Shut much. Up. Shut the fuck up. Oh, up. man. I can save you. Come on, I got you. Dang it. So what if I would have went then? Oh no. No. Shoot, shoot the ice. No, it's not too late. There's nothing more you can do.
How? To the house. We need a how fire. does she get out? But Luke doesn't. What the heck? Just fucking freeze to death. Uh, what? No. Luke. How the fuck did that happen? You're standing right there, Kenny. You can watch it all. There's a fireplace. Jesus Christ. We have to get some more. They're gonna freeze to death. Don't just stand there, Kenny. Appreciate it. He's just gone. Looks fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. It's my fault. I, sh I should have stayed with him. What did I start to tell you? Wasn't nothing any of us could do. You could. God, you could have helped him. Oh, Don't man. Don't listen to her, Clem. This ain't on you. You son of a bitch! This is your fucking fault! Kenny! No, man! To what? It's nobody's damn fault! Take take the blame off him. Just, freezing. Come on, people. Focus on the kid. The fire started. Come on, Kenny. Look at this place. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit, too. What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. You fucking commie piece of shit, Kenny! Fuck you. I figured she would have got hit. That would have knocked some sense in him. Just stop. What did Jane's you like, do to him? What the hell? There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. Waste more time. Let's not get this fire started now. Come on. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is going to help How is beating a kid to death going to help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. Whoa. Oh, I throw on blame here. I'm tying him up. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? He's hurt real bad. Mike. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, uh, uh. You got a light? He really doesn't like me. I thought I had matches. That's how that works. <sighs> so we lost Luke. Take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. Uh oh. Here we go with him in the vehicle. Here. You should eat something. You okay? he's gone I've lost people before but it just hasn't felt this this shitty in a while he cared about you too Jane I know he did there we go god damn it <sighs> I shouldn't have come back I knew this would happen I knew it 
will be okay. Trust me. If you say so. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Trust the little kid. We'll be okay. Thank you. Thank you. You can trust me. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth the crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. Jeez. I'll watch him. Careful, Kenny, what's he going to do to me? Nothing. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. over but AJ needs us now we got to stick together on this thing all right come on let's see if the truck's gonna go my daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up he was a mean some bitch but he taught me respect girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. Okay. I like her. Just give her some time. Just be patient, Kenny. Maybe you're right. Hell, I didn't know what to make of Lee first. Of course, he helped me in mine more times than I can remember. Jane helped us back on the road. All right. Give it a turn. That's a dead battery. We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running. And then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's got to be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. I mean, hell, there's got to be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me. We're going to make it, Clem. I know it. All right, turn it again. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it. We'll get, it, we'll get it working. Give him some hope. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. about a battery from this thingy. Wish they'd finished this place. Okay, Bonnie. We gotta talk. What do you want? Oh, she hates me now. I just wanted to see how you were. How do you think? 
It must be nice being a pretty little girl. No one ever expects you to do a damn thing. Damn, Bonnie. Okay. You and I both know you had a chance to save Luke. You and I both know what happened back there. I got nothing more to say to you. Okay. Looks broken. Well, we can use the generator. Maybe. Busted. Maybe not. She's out there watching. Hey. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! <laughs> Seen that look before. Son of a bitch! I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Glenn. I bet Carver was a nice guy, too. Once. Probably had a nice job, a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. No, Kenny won't do that. Each other a long time. Sooner or later, they're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Seems like you've done that before. Just once or twice. You wanna try? No way. It's gonna puke. Clem, no. Hold it like this. Support the head. Hey. Hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <coughs> it puked. It puked. <laughs> Gross. Gross, says the lady. That's okay. It's rubbing zombie guts all over. There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. <laughs> Can you anyway, get it? Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. So he made it? Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. He got it working. Good job, Kenny. It works. What I tell you. So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Not much. 
We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, a place warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're kind of freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? What the fuck? It was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Jenny, it's freezing up here, man. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> no. Worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man. This is fucking nuts. Jane's right. We should head south. We're going to freeze to death up here. And it's the best thing for the baby. I vote we go back to you. Mike? Sure. What up? Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. No, oh, come on, Kenny. Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he the ain't Rusky. coming. The Rusky. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. We should ask him what he wants. There's a concept. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh, yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. When was that? God damn it! Kenny, are you okay? I mean, Bonnie wants nothing to do with me. Why is she agreeing with me? You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. Close the door. What was that back there? I expected more out of you, Clem. You know, I only want what's best for that child. How could you embarrass me like that? After all we've been through. You're scaring me. Scared? What's there to be scared about? Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem. Think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of I mean, folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. This is different. How? Where are we going to find baby formula? I don't know, but sitting around here ain't a way. <sighs> I really don't know what to do in this situation. I mean, heading up north sounds good because, yeah, snow. I don't trust anyone. I think he'd tell me that he doesn't have all the answers. And to keep my hair short. Snow and obviously freezing the zombies, but then heading back can't south just give up makes on sense because we're not going mean, to freeze it. What's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now. Grown up. I felt pride. A pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. 
Damn it, Kenny. Look around. There's mm. nothing out here. Wellington doesn't exist. It's just a it's just a story. Oh, I thought you that don't know was how much it hurts to hear you say that. That was a lot harsher than I thought, thought it was going to be. Tomorrow, you'll see how wrong you are. Oh, Kenny. I gotta remember, you can't please everybody. It's gonna be a walker just pounding on the door. Mike and the rescue. I can't pull the gun out on them. of it we're just leaving now keep it down all right nobody else has to get involved that's everything we have they're just straight up gonna leave us listen we just gotta get away from that guy clown okay who kenny damn it just we don't have time for this this it's fine just no goddamn rusky Whoa. papa mike jesus god fight we have to go mike just leave her screw you bonnie This is messed up. Uh, Lee? It's just a bad dream, sweet pea. What was it about? Ben! Duck? He's bit. We don't know how this works yet. Maybe it's like a cold. a doctor. Maybe she can help him. It's not like a cold. No, it's probably not. Man. <laughs> Ben's just I asleep back that. there with a gun, holding it on, on uh, who was that, Lily? I 
Lily? I'm a crybaby when I hid the bug in his pillow. Oh, that's okay, honey. You didn't mean it. Lee? Hmm? Why did Lily do that to Carly? I don't know. She was sad. Right? Yeah, so would this have been that different if uh, sometimes. we let Lily Lilith kill Ben instead? Make sense. How come? Because bad things happen to everyone. And it's hard to keep being yourself after they do. What do you think? Should we have left her behind? <sighs> no. Maybe we should have. I don't know. I don't know if we did the right thing. Well, I mean, she How does steal the RV later, but then we get the train. Well, it's not like and that's where we meet Arvo and Krista. Sometimes it just isn't the right answer. I hate math. <laughs> Me too, sweet pea. Uh, but part of growing up is doing what's best for the people you care about. Even if sometimes that means hurting someone else. I don't want to hurt anyone. It's not that easy. I'm scared, Lee. What can I do you to make it better? That you won't leave me. Oh, I wouldn't do that. I promise. This <laughs> sucks. Oh man, it's gonna be all right. <laughs> man, Lee was such a great guy. Now let's try to get some sleep. Wait, peppermint? No, she didn't die. She got shot. She got shot by the Rusky. Okay, Lee. So Bonnie, Mike, and Arvo were going to ditch us. And so that leaves Clem, Kenny, and Jane. On my side. Oh, don't look up and see him as a zombie. Okay, thank gosh. <laughs> that would have been messed up. On the left! Slow down! Shut up! Where's the She's baby? Away. Okay, she, she has a baby. Ouch. Hey, you. Clem! Oh, thank God! You passed out from the shock. What happened? That piece of shit Rusty shot you. We had to run the truck to keep you warm. How do you feel? It hurt. Couldn't find the bullet. Must have gone clean through. It'll burn a while, but... Well, no sons of bitches. Must have gone. You would I see if it went clear through. But Mike, I could tell they were working on something. I didn't think they'd go that far. Yeah, well, who would steal our food and shoot a kid? You never should have thrown in with trash like that in the first place. I can't believe they did that. I don't think they knew what they were doing, except trying to get away. Yeah, well, they're gone now. Good fucking riddance. Now that Clem's awake, we should talk about where we're going. We're headed north. What, to find Wellington? You sure talk a lot of shit, but you got a better plan? We head south, back to house. Carver's camp? What the fuck kind of plan is that? I think Bonnie said there was more formula back there. And we actually know where it is. I don't care where we go. Just please, stop arguing. She's the one that's going off. Because you won't listen to a thing I'm saying. What's that? I mean... You're talking into my bad ear, sweetheart. Jackass. 
Oh, yes, so house has Look, food, but we left it being sworn by zombies, it. and it, it still had guards day. from cult carpets, what, so we can turn around would they let us back in willy-nilly? Whatever. I give up. Get your feet off the dash. <laughs> Let's play the game, Clem. I spy with my little eye an asshole. Your turn. Grow up. Go to hell. I'll pull this fucking car over. Go ahead. You want to die out here? Better than waiting to die next to you. You're both being children. Me? I couldn't see the damn road. Bet you're having trouble seeing a lot of things these days. You shut oh. your fucking mouth. I am done playing games with you, Jane. Fuck you. You don't know a damn thing about me. Oh, I know exactly what you are. Nothing. Nobody cares about you. And you don't care about nobody but yourself. That makes you... Nothing. What is it with you? Okay, that's a It's your harsh. family, right? Don't. It is, isn't it? I'm warning you, you little shit. You're just another type A asshole trying to save a bunch of dead people. Shut up, both of you. Stay out of this, clam. Don't tell her what to do. You listen to me. You mouth off about my family, and I will fucking end you. Jesus Christ, I'm so sick of this wounded warrior crap. This is giving Pull me a over. headache. I can't take this. What? Running away again? What a fucking shocker. In the end, still only care about yourself, right? And where were you when Sarita got bit, Kenny? Huh? Where were you? I was there. I couldn't... God damn you, I love that woman! Who could love you? Look at you. You can't raise this kid. It's scared to death of you. I got this way, saving your ass from that hellhole. And I would have left you to rot if I'd known what you were. Nobody who died is anyone's fault. We... We all wanted to be together, and it just went bad. But we owe it to them to try to make the best of this. I'm sorry, Clem, but I can't put up with this bullshit anymore. Oh, the feeling's mutual. You know the thing about people like you, Kenny? You're just a bomb waiting to go off. Everyone talks about you behind your back because they're afraid of you. That ain't true. Mike, Bonnie, Sarita. Fucking liar, that ain't true. Everyone around you knows that sooner or later, they're going to end up dead. Sarita knew it, I know it, and so does Clementine. I told you not to talk about my family! Fuck you! You fucking piece of shit! Go to hell, you son of a bitch! Road! Man. Jesus! You okay? I'm fine. How's AJ? He's fine. You sure? Yes. Clem, you alright? Yeah. Kenny, I'm... Wait, hold on. Go around. One of them might have diesel. We shouldn't stop here. We're running on fumes. Got no choice. Yeah. When I holler, it's okay. Drive up closer. Anything happens, I'll try to meet you there. All right. There. If you're going, go now. Kenny. That fucking asshole. Let the kid drive. God. I can't do this anymore. I'm serious, Clem. I tried, but I just can't. You're both losing it. Clem, everyone's like that around here. You know that. Clem, we could leave right now. No. Are you serious? We got no what gas. AJ? Look, I, I know you're close to him, but Kenny would never let him go. This is our chance, Clem. Don't you ever want to know what it's like to live your own life? They must not be cold enough yet. Fuck. Get us out of here. I don't know how to drive. See that pedal on the floor? Step on it. Don't Ooh, just sit there. What? Gun got a lot quieter. 
Hear all that? Jane! <sighs> Boy. This is what you get for letting the kid drive a diesel. Jane should just hopped over and driven herself. Oh no, don't tell me. I'm gonna actually shoot shoot Jane or Kenny. Where am I supposed to be going? I don't know. I can go this way too. Gonna go into the forest? There we go. See a zombie right here. Am I supposed to be staying away from them, or...? Okay, yep, that was a zombie. I'm... <laughs> no, who am I gonna end up shooting? This one's not moving. Can't see. That one has a backpack on. I don't think any of our people had had on a backpack. Freeze to death out here. Jane? Kenny? You alright? Yeah. Where is he? Where's the kid? He's with her. You left him with her? Jane? <laughs> Come on, Kenny. Blame me for that. Jane! Wait. Oh, come on, Clementine. I didn't see anything. Oh, thank Christ. She's trying to show me how... Stay 
out of what? You have to trust me. You're gonna see what he really is. Can he zoom come back and kill me? Oh, kill Jane because Jane put a fake dead body somewhere. Kenny, calm down. Don't do anything stupid. Get out of my way. Kenny? How did you kill a fucking child? I didn't kill him. It was an accident, Kenny. I won't back down from you, Kenny. Shut up! I'm warning you. We can't kill each other. Not after all this. We're all that's left. Stay out of this, Clem. Clem, stay back. Don't you come near me, you son of a bitch. Kenny! Get the fuck oh. off! Fuck you! <laughs> What am I supposed to do here? made it. Almost made it. <laughs> we were close, weren't we? Sure. We were, we were just right there. I didn't finish life. I thought I wanted this. Asked for it. So many times. Now that it's happening, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm afraid, Glenn. It's okay, Kenny. You're going to see Katja and Doug. You're going to see them again. Oh, you're always good for a smile.
I mean, she did all of this to prove a point, which she proved, but still, it got Kenny killed. If anybody thinks you killed a kid, they're gonna be pissed. I understand if you're upset. AJ was never in any danger. I was just going to try to talk you into coming with me. I just thought if you saw Kenny like that, you'd know we'd have to leave him. Look, Clem, I'm sorry. I didn't think Kenny would go that far. You, you knew he was going. We're all safe. We're going to be okay. I don't understand. Kenny was dangerous. And I needed you to see that, one way or another. What are you saying? I had to do it, Glenn. You saw how he reacted. I had to show you what he was capable of. It was a stupid plan. I should never have lied to you. But I thought it was the only way you'd see. Oh, my God. Kenny, you have to forgive me. Please. We can just leave all this behind us. Please. I did it for you, Clem. For us. We're free now. I forgive you, Jane. Thank you. Thank you, Clem. You were right about Kenny. All along, you knew what he was gonna do. It's over now, Clem. Let's just... I like how now that all this is going on, the wind's cleared up. There's, you can see everything. You're, you're fine. You're not freezing to death. It just changed just like that. What I mean, what, what was Clem supposed to do? Like, she's alone now. If she stays away from uh, from Jane, alone with a kid. Can't see much from here. Come on. Jesus Christ. I'm glad you didn't have to see that happen. Let's keep moving. Here's the food. Clem, this formula. Thought he was right. The greenhouse is in good shape. You know, maybe we should stay here a while. See how it goes. Just, just stay behind me. Clem. I mean, she didn't hear them talking? Come on. They don't look armed. Is this your place? It's big. Yeah, it is. Really? Yeah? Why? We need help. My boy, he... He ain't doing so good. What's wrong with him? Look, uh, don't worry. He ain't, uh, he ain't bit. Just hungry. And we've been walking for weeks. Ran out of food a couple days back. That's your kid? Yeah, it's my kid. <laughs> this, Where are you going, This 12, 11-year-old. It's, this is my kid. Yeah. Why do you care? Whoa, I, I didn't mean nothing by it. Everywhere. All over. You, uh, been up north? Yeah. Yeah, us too. Keep your eye on him. This place needs a lot of work. Yeah? Yeah, we could help you. There's not that much food left. Please. We won't make it another night out here. Look, 
I know you don't know us, and I know a lot of people out here say a lot of things, but I'm asking you, as a father, please don't turn us away. I don't know, Clem. It could be anybody. Do we really want to go through this again? Well, I mean, we're just two people with the kid. One adult. Please. Oh my gosh. We'll die out here. How are we going to take just give us defend this whole gigantic give place us all by to ourselves? Prove ourselves? You won't regret it. I promise you. You have to let us in. Come in. <sighs> Thank you. Around the side. You sure about this? This place is a mess. And I don't know how long that food will last. It'll take a lot of work. Maybe we can start yeah, something here, We can here, start our Jane. own thing here. It's not much. But we'll make it better. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Twelve-year-olds here are making all the big decisions. Just keep your eyes on them. I'll be fine. My name's Patricia. Jane. Thank you, Jane. Don't mention it. Thank you so much. Of course. Thank you so much. Yeah, I feel if we would have turned them away, they probably would have shot. Cool hat. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> the hell hugs nowadays? Well. That's how it ends, just like that? We invite three people and then it just ends? <sighs> oh boy. Protected the baby. You and 68% of people protected. Yeah, that's at the very beginning during the firefight. We crawled all the way and ran towards the baby. Went to help Luke. 66 did not try to help Luke. I mean, I helped him. I shot the, the, the zombies walking up on him. Future corpse is on with you watching. Hey there. Ask to leave with Mike. You and 80% of the players didn't ask to leave with Mike. Oh, when they're in the truck. Oh, we could could that have no, that probably would have changed anything. The 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 the, the, the Rusky still probably would have shot me as I approached because he hated me. Because I was the one that killed his sister. Even though I killed his sister as a zombie and not the one that actually shot that killed the sister. Oh, that's an even split. That's or no, point nine shot Kenny. That's 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 gonna be an even split. In the end, who are you with? You and twenty one percent of players are with Jane and the family. So I'm on that is a big low side, twenty one point four percent. So then I guess you could be by yourself without Jane there if you would have said, I can't forgive you for her treachery, her trickery, I should say. So you could just be you and the family. That's interesting. That was good. Didn't like the ending too much. I wish he would have given a little bit more with that. And shown like. Shown some progress as them like actually becoming like a group. Like repairing stuff. Give us a little bit of there. So. Peppermint. That is game over for this uh, season. This is season two. So now we'll be on season three. Which was like the road 
far behind or something like that. Future corpse. Yeah, this one's done. Yeah. Yeah, so I have the other seasons to play. I have season three, four, and then uh, uh, the the Michonne uh, saga. Not saga, series. So, yeah. But yeah, this is definitely a great game. I highly recommend this if anyone has not played this. Great game. No, this is not the last season, Peppermint. So technically, I guess you could say I'm like a third way through this this bundle that I got. I just want to see if there's anything at the end of this with you guys. But yeah, like I said, after noise, <laughs> after after this series is over. I think I'm going to be doing a Detroit Become Human, so that'd be a, that'd be a, a fun series to play. I heard a lot of positive things about that. I played Heavy Rain, and those two games are from the same creators, so that would be a, a fun one. Because Heavy Rain, I seen after beating it, I watched other playthroughs, skimmed through those ones, and the game can change drastically. So I'm excited for that one. Let's see if there's anything after this. And then I'll confirm what the next uh, season is going to be for the next time I start streaming on Sunday night. Well, Friday night, tomorrow night, I might be doing a friendly game stream with some some of my friends. But Sunday would be the start of my uh, season three. Let's see. Yeah, season one, season two, and then a new frontier. As the world falls apart, Javier Garcia fights to keep his family together while Clementine searches for the last person she has left. So then, yeah, a uh, lovely spoon pointed out, is this going to be AJ growing up? Because Clementine looks a lot older right there. Or is this going to be that uh, other kid that just joined our group with that family? Or is that going to be just some random kid from this this season? But yeah, who knows? Who knows? Um, well, most likely you need the other kid. Eh, yeah, most likely. Because like, they're about the same height. I don't imagine a kid to grow that fast. <laughs> Catch up to Clementine. But... That is it for tonight, folks. Thank you for watching. And like I said, I might be doing a, a friend stream tomorrow night, playing some other game. And then Sunday, we'll continue with a new friend tier. Yeah, 12 years older than AJ. So if, if AJ is like five or six, hmm. I mean, yeah, no, that, that can't be AJ. That makes you think what happens to AJ then. Uh oh. So, <laughs> I don't want to think about that. We just went through hell to keep him. But yeah, anyways, I'm rambling now. Thank you all for watching. Have a good one.